I loved how they were just playing a bit of a game with people from the get-go. When they first exhibited it, they claimed it to be a collection of African pieces and art that they'd collected. And then you just come in and start to see the traces of, of, of McDonald's and the happy, shiny face of capitalism just peeping up. It placed them in, in history rather than as a shiny new thing, which I thought was great. Irreverence appealed hugely because a lot of my material will be talking about some quite serious and heavy stuff, but particularly in the live shows and in live forms, I'll add a level of, of playfulness and humour to kind of give a greater impact to the serious message. And their work feels like it's instantly um, challenging or controversial, but executed so well and with a set of playfulness that, yeah, I love. So this is the piece I've written inspired by uh, the Chapman family collection and it's called Masks. 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 Masks of the municipal mask mark seen as immiscible. Inimical impacts fade with invisible principles as economical windfalls act as colonics for the sinful. Demonical becomes dominical. Take fake smile and paint on Satan, then paint him as your new patron. Capitalism's jolly mascot, death's desperate dressed up despot, all hail this grinning crackpot. All hail this grinning crackpot. Sacrifice to him our livestock. Sacrin smiles from him and his flock. And give to him our kith and kin. And slowly watch their hearts block. Lay upon thy altar your pound of flesh or just a quarter. And pay no heed to all the deeds they hide behind thy warder. Masks. Masks. <laughs>